All right, ladies and gentlemen, another episode, Master Modes Film Session. I'm excited about this one because we're talking about the gunslinger, number seven, Ben Roethlisberger, and his big third and 14 completion to Eric Ebron. So you know how we do this thing. We'll play it at full speed, and after that, we'll break it down. And right here is Eric Ebron lined up inside number three spot. All righty. So it <clears throat> started out, man. The Steelers are in a, a three by one um, alignment. Obviously, you have the three receivers to the top. OK, so you have Deontay, Chase, Ebron, and then Juju's the lone receiver to the bottom. It's 11 personnel, meaning one running back, one tight end. All right. Now for the Titans on defense, they're showing a cover four concept. OK, so you have this corner playing off two safeties high middle of the field and then this guy's off so it gives you the perception of a cover four but they're going to morph into a cover three post snap okay so this guy is going to be your curl flat defender all right and then this safety he's not going to give any ground he's going to stay there because once the play starts to progress you'll see that that's where his job's going to be anyways okay so we're starting out give it a little slow motion here so this guy, all he's trying to do right now is get in Juju's way, okay? Because we know the Steelers have been doing a good job of the, the short to intermediate, the underneath routes and stuff like that. So even though his responsibility is bottom of the numbers, he's going to, you know, feather this a little bit to make sure Juju can't just get off like he would like to. Safety, like I said, he's not getting, he's not giving in, uh, any depth because ultimately he's going to be a hook curl defender, right? So that's supposed to be where his drop is. Obviously, he's playing a lot deeper because of the down and distance. Good job, where good sticks awareness and situational awareness by him. This guy, not so much. So you see, from a safety perspective, he understands the depth that you need. This linebacker, he doesn't gain a lot of depth. He stays in the middle of the field where initially, or his responsibility should be right out here. You know, 10 to 12 yards from the snap of the ball and being outside the hash by one or two yards. So he doesn't get to his landmark. So that's why Ebron is able to find this soft spot in the cover three. And it's a good job by him in terms of the depth that he wanted to run this route at. You want to make sure that you go above the linebackers, but you want to be beneath where these safeties are, these uh these third deep third defenders. And he does a great job of doing that. But really right here, man, this guy, he falls asleep. He has to get more depth, man. When you're playing on third and 14, that's not the drop you want at 10 yards because obviously the ball can go behind you and now it's the first down you want to keep the ball in front of you in these scenarios and yeah this guy just doesn't do a good job of that good job by ebron like i said man taking this route behind linebacker depth so that way you don't have to worry about him but you keep it shallow so that way this safety can't get to you now this corner he definitely could have had a little bit more to do with the play since he's not threatened by anyone out here at the number one receiver spot but ultimately man good job by ebron finding the soft spot great job by the offensive line protecting ben more importantly man you look at just the the protection that he has on this play this pocket is beautiful beautiful job man standing up keeping his pocket clean anytime seven gets a good pocket man he's able to set his feet you know he's going to do something special here but yeah great job by the guys up front great job by ebron make sure he keeps it you know at the proper depth and then finding that soft spot and then good job by seven man step in beautiful throw hits him right where he needs to protect him as well you don't want to lead him too far this way but ultimately, man, really good job, man. And ultimately, great finish by Ebron, man. It was a big play. Ultimately helped them, you know, to continue to produce and have that offensive outburst that we saw in the first half by this team. And here it is again from the end zone. You'll just be able to see Ben's eyes, Ebron's depth. Like I said, 55, man, he definitely goes too far over man but as a whole great job by the offense right there